Well, the West Harden Oilers haven't seen a winning season since 2011. After not much change in his first couple of seasons as head coach, George Taylor decided the team needed to play an outlaw schedule to find their identity again. So let's see how the time away from the UIL treated the Oilers. We started with 22 kids. We finished the season with 15 football players in the whole high school. So we were kind of at ground zero right there. Our program barely had life. Last season, Oilers head coach George Taylor made some serious renovations to West Harden's football program. When I got here, we played UIL district football. Last year, we were outlaw schedule, so we didn't play UIL football. We did that to grow the program, which I think we accomplished last year. We grew the program. Uh, they're excited to play football now, so we're back in UIL, and, uh, and now they're showing up ready to compete for a district championship. The Oilers use their outlaw schedule to change the way they play football. A new brand of football on the field. We, you know, we're kind of a uh, high flying circus. We throw the ball around. Uh, we get the ball to athletes in space, which is different than what they're accustomed to. Um, you know, my first couple of years here. So it's a little more exciting. Now West Harden is sticking to the basics to make sure that player growth continues. We're trying to get all the offense installed, which, you know, with the kids showing up this summer and us being able to work with the kids a little bit in the summer on football, we're way ahead of schedule, which helps us out because we don't really get the, the two a days that a lot of schools are getting. You know, last year we went into our first scrimmage and we had four run plays and two pass plays. That's it. So right now we're, you know, as far as install, we're very, very multiple this early in the season. Since a majority of the Oilers roster is young, this next season is all about building their rig. Now we're going to battle with kids that will be on the varsity field for three, four years in a row. So the goal coming in this year is not to get in the UIL and just, you know, have fun playing UIL. Our goal is to make the playoffs this year. And being such a young team, um, you know, with the exception of a couple seniors, this whole team will be back next year and ready to go again.